All right, I'm Nick. Earlier this year, we did a video on how to catch triggerfish. The video was really focused on how to catch them in calm weather. I showed you a really, really cool rig that I've been using for years. It always works, it's awesome. But it doesn't always shine, right? There are some times throughout the year where the current is just moving too quick, it's just too hard to get the lure down, and it's not enough weight. So then you end up using crazy rigs and all these different things. It's kind of complex and sometimes you use dropper rigs and all kinds of stuff, but I've never really been happy with those choices. And I've always kind of like, man, I wish it was a better way, right? So we sell a ton of sheep's head jigs in the fall. They're super simple things. Here's a video of them. You can see we use a Gorilla Light hook. We use the swivel. That way, if you bend a hook, you can just swap out the hook to a new one. So I got to thinking and I was like, hey, it was the night before the trip. I had a charter with Mike and you'll see some clips here in a minute. I was like, man, I wonder if I can just put a circle hook on the jig. So I did. And we were able to catch these fish using the circle hook on the swing jig, super easy without any issues. Here's some video clips. All right, drop it. Close, Bill. He's on. Ooh. Real slow, real keep real slow. There you go. We'll find out what it is. There's been a bunch of snapper and trigger fish down there. We took a sheep's head jig. We took the gorilla light hook off and we put a circle hook on there. And now we're catching trigger fish. Current's pretty bad, so our typical trigger fish rig with the light weight wasn't getting it done. Had to make an adjustment. Slow and steady. Angry fish. Our circle hook has definitely seen better moments, so we'll just take it nice and easy. Hopefully it turns out to be gray. Oh, snapper. oh, it's a snapper. These darn endangered red things won't leave us alone. Where is he at? There you go. Nice one. Nice fish. Well then. Alright, go ahead and open it. Go ahead and close, Bill. Rod tip down, there he is. For real, for real, for real, you got him. And then just let him run. That hook is, that hook has seen uh, better days. That's probably the right species though. All right, we're using the sheep's head jigs to go trigger fishing today. What's it gonna be? Oh, it's a baby trigger fish. Yep. A little baby trigger fish. We already got one keeper. That right there is a baby. It's so easy, I decided to put them on the website. You can follow the link below. You guys can order some for yourself. It's super easy, you saw it in the video. If you have any questions, let me know. Remember, you wanna use a circle hook because you don't wanna have to set the hook. You'll miss a bunch of fish. You wanna be able to just reel into them and have them. It's easy. Trigger fish nibble when they feed, super simple stuff, small bait, you're good to go. If you have any questions, comment below. Thanks for watching.